So guys, we are here in Brazil, Salvador, <laughs> Salvador de Bahia. So I, I recorded a video in Brazilian Portuguese and I was saying something like, I'm going to tell you, yes, something like I'm very conscious when I speak Brazilian Portuguese and the way I speak English, I'm very confident, very confident in French, English, Creole, but Brazilian Portuguese, I'm always like scared that people won't understand me because of my French accent, but it's not something that is bothering me when I speak English, you see, but but it's not why I'm recording this video today. I'm going to speak to you, talk to you about toxic people and abusive. People. So lately I've been thinking a lot. Uh, I've been thinking a lot because things happen, things happen, you know, the last months and I was thinking about should I should I close the door more? <laughs> no, when I said that, it's more like I was assessing some people. This is what I was doing. I was assessing some people and saying to myself, should this person or should these people stay in my life, remain in my life? You know. So I was assessing this. And I said to myself, I need to pray about it. I need to pray about it. I need to ask God what is his what is his will for me regarding um, these people you know and you know I grew up like in a, in a dysfunctional family and I didn't have peace when I grew up you know it was chaos and I managed to succeed in chaos it was chaos abusive people you know the people they say they love you but they are hurting you at the same time or they say they love you but they don't want you they don't want to see you succeeding and sometimes it's like they smile at you but at the same time they add the back <laughs> so and sometimes you are you are yourself confused because you don't really know like how to re react with some people in your family or the people you call friends because they have like two faces like a good one and a bad one and every time you think about the bad one you remind yourself yes but at the same time this person is not that bad you know so and i don't do that i don't do that anymore to me if you are if you are acting like the enemy and when i say acting like the enemy i mean if you come here to kill to rob me and to destroy me so acting like the enemy you are out simple as that i don't need to see more if you are acting like the enemy if you are constantly lying uh, if you are trying to destroy me you are not good for me simple as that but these people i said to myself i need to talk to god i need to to pray about uh for them i need to pray about the situation and let god guide me with them what i should do what i need to do okay it's very important because to me it's important that god approve the people in my life you know because you don't see everything you can't see everything you won't see everything so god only knows so to me i'm gonna pray i didn't pray but i'm gonna pray tonight and ask god what he wants me to do regarding these people if they should remain stay in my life or if they should go you know and someone was saying to me yeah but jesse you are already uh, you don't have a lot of people in your life and that's true i don't have a lot of people in my life because i i because to me peace is very important you know peace is it very important i want to be at peace in my life and i'm not i'm not willing to compromise that to have uh, uh, many people in my life you know to me uh, it's more important quality than quantity okay quality over quantity you know when we were in high school we had like many friends it was nice yes we had like a desire to fit in to to fit in and to be in a group but today it's not the same thing i don't have the same energy okay i don't like drama I don't like being uh, around toxic and abusive people so uh, quality over quantity i to me god has to approve 
all the people in my life. You know, if he said no, the door is open, you can go. Ciao, ciao. Okay? Hey, hey, so. <laughs> no, but guys, more seriously, this is it to me. It's like either you are approved by God, if you are not, the door is open and bye bye. Bye bye, negative toxic and abusive people i don't need that in my life i don't have this type of energy anymore so i don't have i'm 35 i know i i look 25 but i am 35 years old i don't have this type of energy anymore sorry but no 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 i am more selective but always with god i'm not saying i'm making i'm doing things by myself i always pray before doing something so that's why i said to you i need to pray i need to pray because I want peace of mind and I want peace in my life, you know, peace. I wake up with peace, I, I go to bed with peace, so I need to maintain that in my life. It's very important to have peace. And to me, peace is underrated. I'm telling you, peace is underrated. It's very important to me to have peace in my life. Uh, so I think that's it. This is what I wanted to share with you today. So thank you so much for being with me till the end. See you soon.